Yeah, we've stopped all cricket activities for the next 60 days. Um, that includes the 50 over competition, the more day competition, but also all other cricket and cricket activities. We've got a lot of activities within the development space um, during the off season, so that's been stopped as well. We encourage people to act very responsibly. Um, the world's in crisis. We've got to react in a way um, that safeguard lives. Uh, we met with the minister in, in a very good meeting and I think the theme that came out, out of that is a life saved today is a fan for tomorrow. So we encourage people that even some of the leagues not on our auspices, please do the right thing. Um, don't go ahead with the activities. Um, the Cricket South Africa board has established the EXCO of three board members uh, to speed up the uh, decision making. They've made money available should the coronavirus need uh, to be addressed with immediate expenses. There will be a strategy that's rolled out for all staff working in cricket. That will be done in the next um, week. Um, this is a, a very serious situation and we've got to safeguard people uh, as far as possible. So we call on all people within cricket um, to do the right thing here. Yeah, staff's going to work remotely. We'll have a protocol in terms of, of testing, but uh, where possible staff will work remotely. We got the pro tiers back, um, which is, is wonderful. So uh, it will be ma uh, managed um, on, a, on a weekly basis. But again, you know, safety, safety first for all staff and all people involved. Yeah, look, we stopped all activities at this stage. So that, that's where we are. Um, We'll play it um, as it develops, uh, the virus, and we'll also look at uh, best practices around the world. I've got to compliment Dr. Um, Shoaib Manjra and uh, Ash uh, Ramji for um, the sterling leadership that they've provided, and they will be in future also uh, providing us um, direction in, in this so that we have a medical expert opinion going forward. We've been very fortunate in terms of the timing that uh, we towards the end of our season and there's no incoming tour for a couple of months uh, during the winter. So it hasn't impacted financially that big on us for now. We've got to take into account uh, the world and the changing of the world financially and that'll impact. But for now, we've all almost been protected a little bit, but we are planning, we are doing scenario planning. Um, again, we don't want to panic. We don't want to look too far down the road because we need data to react immediately. But for now, um, you know, we've been talking to our sponsors. I want to thank Momentum for allowing us to um, cancel the, uh, the tournament. They've been brilliant. Um, I think they've been responsible in, in actually uh, asking us not to go ahead with it. Um, but you know, the world in crisis, the world's got to sit down and, and, and look for problems. So for now, I don't want people to panic too much about our financial situation. There will be a negative impact, but we, I'm sure that we can mitigate it. Yeah, to all our sponsors and stakeholders, thank you for supporting us in this very difficult time. Thank you for understanding and, and, and thank you for reaching out to us and, and assuring us that uh, it is time to stand together. It is a time to stand together. And to our fans out there, you know, do the responsible thing. Um, be safe, um, wash your hands, um, look after your family, protect yourself. Uh, we want to use sport as a, as a voice to go out there and saying to people that there'll be a time where again we can celebrate as fans. For now, be safe. Yeah, I want to thank the BCCI for allowing us to recall the protest. It's not an easy decision to, to be made. You know, there's a, a big financial implications for India uh, on it, so we will return. We will honour our agreement and our fixtures, but again, you know, we've got to thank them for understanding in this difficult time, um, you know, the things uh, that they considered was such that the players came first. Yeah, so I guess a lot of people will ask, you know, who wins the 50 over competition in the four days and, and um, Graham Smith, director of cricket and, and his department will have a look at it. We had to make an immediate call if the tournament's going on or not. We have a bit more time to decide. How do we distribute uh, um, you know, prize money and how do we award winners? So we got a bit of time and we'll apply our mind to it. But um, like I said, the immediate call was necessarily because we were in the semi-final phase. But uh, soon we'll communicate that as well. We give all the difficult passes to Graham Smith nowadays so he can deal with it.